Hi guys, um, one quick thing before the video starts, first of all, this video was originally going to be one part, but I had to make it two because it was so long, so that's why it's in two separate, separate things. Um, I didn't get a chance to finish this because I made it on March 19th yesterday, but today's March 20th, so that's when I'm putting it up. And um, the first part is going to be me talking about it and unboxing it, and um, I guess that's about it right now. Enjoy part one, guys. Hello, everybody, again. It's me, Chris. I know, I know. But today, I'm going to talk about how I decided to get it, um, how I bought it, why I decided to get it. I, I said that I'm like, I'm such a screw. How I decided to get it, why I got it, how I got it, a recreation of unboxing it and show you some features of it and reviewing it and all that crap of my fairly new silver 80 gigabyte 6th generation iPod silver. I think that's what it's called. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. So anyway, after Christmas last year, I didn't get it an iPod and I was just for some reason really hyped up to get one I was like oh my gosh I have to get an iPod you know I was so psyched about getting one that um that camera this should be better okay you know and I was really just thinking about you know I really wanted one and I thought about getting the zoom because some of it was cheaper Later found out I was a piece of crap, to, you know, deciding between that and the Apple and blah, blah, blah. And eventually I saw on the iPod, but then you gotta think, which iPod are you gonna get? So, I thought about that for a while, and I did look at the iPod Touch, and I do think I did rush my decision to get the iPod Classic, but you know what? I um, stand by my decision even today. So... For a couple reasons. First of all, mine has 80 gigabyte memory. The iPod Touch has um, memory starting at 8 gigabytes, which is one tenth of that, and that costs fifty dollars more for one tenth of the memory. Now I would use up the 8 gigabyte probably right away, so I would want at least 16 gigabyte. By the way, they have 32 gigabyte now, but it's like 500 G's. And even if I got the 16 gigabyte, it would cost like $150 more than the 80 gigabyte. And for someone as financially challenged as me, that's a lot of G's. And you know, I thought the iPod Classic would be cool enough to have everything I want for me personally. So that's probably another reason why I got it. So any any anyway, you're wondering how I got here. Well, I ordered the iPod on December 28th, 2007, I believe. It was delivered the day we had to go back to school on January 2nd, 2008. So I've had it about two and a half, closer to three, we'll say two and a half months, okay? So, anyway, after I got all that out of my system, I'm going to do a kind of a recreation of unboxing the iPod Classic. So... Hopefully I don't break the camera here because I really don't want to do that. I'm going to show you. This is the box. The iPod Classic, okay? This right here in front of your very eyes is the box for you. You know, 80 gigabyte, iPod Classic, blah, blah, blah. You guys get the picture, okay? I'm going to open it up. And look, now obviously I've opened this because I've had it for a while, but you know what? Just for the fun of it, I decided to open it again. Look, at there it is. It. Shiny silver screen. The back, very nice iPod. 80 gigabyte. And then, there's still more inside the box. Yippee. Get out, you stupid. Okay, here we go. Now like this, came with a little pamphlet, instructions, blah blah blah, all that boring crap. 
headphones, very important, and also the cord to connect it to your PC. So you can actually put stuff on there, and a little stand crap, I don't know what it is, blah 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 blah. And also, I have the official thing that, because I ordered it from PC Connection Online, it was the greatest deal, no tax, no shipping, $230. Thank you guys for watching part one. I know it got screwed up at the end, you know, because I wasn't planning on doing this. But that was me basically just explaining the order sheet that I got online and great price of me breaking. So it's not a big deal. And um, thank you and hope to see you watch part two. Kahoot! Yes.